This episode's called Tempo. Could be with dancing, could be in the middle of a game, could be with practice, I don't know, but there's lots of different tempos you gotta find in life, you know? Bars. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again with Haikyuu, season two. That was a bar right there. Episode six, Tempo. Last episode, we had a clash of hmm, we have a clash i'm just gonna say between hinata and kageyama and they need to work on themselves hinata definitely needs to work on themselves we got a little bit of a glimpse at the potential of something that could be in the works between them and from then on i'm just excited to get practice to go into this other training practice then they get into the tournament so season two so far is a banger i'm loving it kicking it off obviously 10 out of 10 for sure animation sound characters always on point remember guys if you guys want early access to the next bunch of episodes i i upload and get full length to this show and all the other shows i'm watching and support me at the same time consider checking out that patreon down below it always is an option for you and if you guys want to support me and patreon's not really your thing if you could just leave a like and a nice comment down below it really pushes me out there into the algorithm and i appreciate trust me all the likes you guys give you guys are some of the best likers i swear like i'll be have like you guys just like it all the time i appreciate y'all but uh let's hop into this haikyuu season two episode six i know kageyama saw that sign of kids volleyball last episode maybe what are you doing here oikawa he teaches kids volleyball that's so cool. Wait, don't tell me that's old man Ukai. The the old the, the great coach. Yeah, the the goat coach, Nekomada's fucking rival, man. Come on, old man Ukai. <laughs> Kochi. Yeah, bro, you're working with his legacy. You gotta be good, okay? Come on. The Nationals, this man. I love him already. I love super intimidating teachers. I love, I love strong teachers in anime. Hell yeah, you gotta respect that. Oh, <laughs> that flash. Oh, I'm going to cry. Good. And that puts an end to the argument with Kageyama. Uh, he's like, I'm going to be doing this ultimately. And he's it's, it's great because... I'm going to pause it real quick because I'm going to start getting used to pausing it again in, in episodes. You guys somewhat appreciate that. And I appreciate you guys appreciating that. But... I find it so awesome that Hinata is going to uh, someone who was someone who coached the ace because Hinata's wanting to evolve. He wants to be the ace. He's the decoy, but you know, he wants to evolve into that ace. So he's talking to the guy who, you know, is the king of evolving people into aces. And then Kageyama's having setter issues. So he goes to the great king fucking Oikawa. It's literally poetic. And of course, oh, it's his nephew. That makes sense. I thought he'd be teaching this. <laughs> back, 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 back. He said, take a picture. That is hilarious. I'm glad his nephew called him out. <laughs> Lamo. Yeah, he's been doing it on instinct. He wants to do it on free will. <laughs> Why not let him? I was about to say, that sounds like something the old king would say. Oh, Kyle was telling him what he needs to hear. And that's exactly what Ukai just said. Okawa oh, knows, man. That's what I'm saying. I'm glad he said that. 
I love Oikawa. That's my boy. <gasps> you fucked it up, Takaru. He definitely fucked up the picture. All right, all right, middle blocker. Let's see you do it. Right? This is the first time he's ever felt like that ever in volleyball. Third tempo. That's the title of the episode, Tempo. Hell yeah. What is, what are these tempos? It has to do with the rate at which they run, they speed the game. What's the, first tempo? Yep, what's going on? Interesting. The agility in any attack is determined by its tempo. Sweet, sweet. I feel like I'm getting a lesson. Got it. Got it. Okay. Makes sense. But you need to... Yes, yes. Even though you're doing it without understanding it, you need to know. Yes. Fair enough. Fair enough. Is he going to get Kageyama? I think he's going to get Kageyama. Wow, I like that. That's a bar. He was just working to get to the top. Now he needs to fight at the top. Yep. I knew he's going to get Kageyama. This fucking guy. Can we get... Can we get Ukai that we have? A blonde Ukai. I love him. But can we also get old Ukai too? They're both fucking awesome. <laughs> he's turned around the corner right there. Do first tempo with anyone, okay. <laughs> he almost said he's in junior high. That's hilarious. Wow. Control that moment. That's dope. This, I'm telling you, old man Ukai is something else. I can understand why they would fucking, why he'd be as renowned as he is. Yeah. Not in front of girls. Or in front of the vice principal. Anywhere else? Gucci. Golden. Got it. Makes a lot of sense. Asahi's doing his own practice. Okay. I fuck with Asahi in his own little personal arc. He doesn't. He knows fucking. He not just only going to improve. So for him, he has to have another attack method. I fuck with Asahi so much. And I love how we took inspiration from the other guys at the, at the training they were just at. Wait, hitting some of your tosses? There's no way. Watery was so nasty. Oh, this is, this training arc is unparalleled. Next level. Brazil, they're looking at the, they're not looking at the national teams. Yeah, the combo masters. So we got working on serves, working on tosses, working on fucking everything, working on fucking combos. 
Working on our character development? Come on. Nice. I haven't seen Tsukushima and Yamaguchi in a fucking goddamn year, feels like. Hey, everyone's improving, or at least trying to improve like crazy. I know even Yamaguchi is on the back end. Yep, he's working on his jump floater. That's my boy Yamaguchi. Can't wait for him to use that one day successfully. He matched. He. Ooh. How the fuck was he able to just walk outside it like that? He's flexible. He definitely, instead of. Instead of Kageyama flex being flexible to him, he's a lot more flexible too. I love it. Oh, I love that. I agree with that. Most definitely. I love that. That was dope. Kageyama got it. Summer, okay. Yep, we're going back to that starting tomorrow, and it's summer, so no more school restrictions, you know. Let's go. Man, this is like a training season, but this is a training episode in a training season, and fuck, man, did I just like it so much, bro. Seeing old man Ukai, seeing Oikawa again was so nice, learning so much about our character development, our team getting inspiration from the teams we just saw, like, um, let me see if I can remember, uh, Tarako from Ubugawa inspiring Asahi for his serves, which is amazing, Shinzen inspiring our boys with the combos, I fucking love it, you know, it's just... It's like, it's, it's like we're not just screaming to get better. Like, there's so much thought, effort, evolution that gets put into it, you know? I love how uh, Ukai was like, Nekomata, you know, his, his, his senses are second to none. Like, I was just saying that last episode. Like, this man, how in the middle of sets, he's able to not only observe his own team, but observe other teams to this much of a fucking degree. That man is a genius. And it's like... And easily, I can tell why Ukai is as renowned as he is as well. That man is easily a genius. He's like that old man who just knows so much, you know? He's just lived like 75 million years, and he just knows so much, you know? Like, oh, I love old... I loved seeing him. I love that flash he got to the little giant. Oh, this show, this season, chef's kiss, you know? Like, I haven't even written down... The only thing I wrote down last episode was just I wrote, wrote down Bokuto's name, so I have that down. And I didn't write down anything this episode. That's how you know this is good, you know? That's how you know it's killing it. Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Well, I appreciate you guys. I'm out of here. Um, catch you guys soon. Peace out, y'all.